Hello, everyone. We are here with Michael today. Michael is our member spotlight um, for these next couple of weeks, and we're excited just to get to know Michael a little bit more. Um, so Michael, just first kind of tell us um, where you work, what you do, all that kind of good stuff. Yeah, uh, well, I work for Entergy Arkansas. Uh, I've been employed with them for about 20 years, uh, currently serve in the capacity of, as the vice president of customer service. 20 years, that's a lifetime. It is. It's hard, <laughs> hard to believe. Certainly didn't expect to work there 20 years when I first started, but it's been a great run. The rest is history now. Well, how long have you been in Rotary? Uh, late 2017, uh, I joined and been active since then. Very good. So what's one of your favorite memories from being a Rotarian? Well, I, I guess I, I mean, I don't know that I have one specific memory, but the community initiatives, you know, is what really resonates with me, such as like the drug take back days. Uh, energy is very big in the community support and involvement. And I guess 20 years at the company, that mindset just kind of becomes part of your DNA. Mm -hmm. So it's certainly the, the service to the community that, that resonates the most with me. I've personally been blessed with, you know, a, a good career. And it's so important to try to make a difference in the lives of others that may not be quite as fortunate. So. Yeah, and then that, that's amazing. Now, I know you personally sit on some boards around town and um, a lot of the nonprofits in town, I will say thank you on all of our behalf for all of the great work Entergy does as well. So thank you very much. It's a pleasure to be associated with it. Yeah, so tell us, um, okay, let's get to know you a little bit better. Um, what's okay. something fun and unique about yourself that might not, everyone might not know? Uh, that's, that's a difficult question for me because I don't think I'm, uh, well, I mean, my kids would probably tell you I'm not all that fun. Um, but I guess maybe something unique because I, I probably have way too many hobbies. Um, I love to barbecue cook. I actually did that competitively at one point for a few years. Uh, love to do just about anything on the water, whether that's just spending time with family or traveling around the country like I've done the last couple of years up until the pandemic uh, with a group of friends that we all fly fish together. I uh, love golf. Um, I enjoy camping, particularly with my 10 year old daughter who really likes to get out and explore. Um, so I really need to narrow it down because, you know, when you find those free weekends and, and co cooperating weather, I just, I kind of want to do all those things. So, um, anyway, full hobbies, I guess I should say. Oh, I love it. Well, you're going to have to have us all over for barbecue when we can get together again. Sounds like a plan. And maybe, oh, maybe we can go to camping with your daughter and family and barbecue all at the same time. We can tie it Even all in together. Even better. <laughs> Okay, well, so we are going to get back together one of these days, hopefully sooner rather than later for our Rotary meetings. Michael, tell us what you're most looking forward to when we get back together in person. Well, I think it's probably what everybody's, you know, missing and hoping to get back to sooner than later. And that's just that physical interaction. Um, much like many people, I've been working at home since March of 2020. And, you know, it's, it's rare or weird to think about going to the office, which I do occasionally. Uh, as kind of a vacation, but it certainly has, you know, turned the world upside down. And so certainly that face-to-face -face interaction that, that I think everybody's missing and, and yearning for is what, what I'm most looking forward to, so. Well, when we're back together face-to-face, -to -face, um, everyone help us congratulate Michael on being one of our Rotarian member spotlights. Michael, thank you so much for sharing some time with us today. And again, congratulations. Thank you.